How's it going, everybody? So in this video, I am going to talk about what to buy at the grocery store to build the muscle. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate um, the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999. Um, so yeah, this is quite, quite easy to do. Um, what a lot of people think is a lot of people think that um, it's expensive to eat healthy or that um, or that processed foods are cheap or, or, or stuff like that. I'm here to tell you right now that even if you're on a budget, eating healthy is actually way cheaper than buying processed foods. So for example, I bought some Ritz crackers the other day. I think they were like four or five dollars for like a pack of Ritz. Um, on the same token, I bought some oatmeal. The oatmeal was I think four dollars. So it was actually a little bit cheaper than the Ritz crackers. Now the Ritz crackers, um, I ate the box in about a day and a half. And it, there wasn't a lot. There was maybe, I had, uh, I had a little bowl full twice and then the next day I had a little bit extra and that was it, they were all gone. The oatmeal is 2.2 pounds of oatmeal. So that oatmeal will last me roughly a month or so for $4. So um, the key for building muscle while buying at the grocery store, obviously, um, what a lot of people do is they waste their money on protein. Protein is by far the most expensive macronutrient um, because it comes from meat. Majority of the time it's meat. So meat is more expensive. Um, to build muscle, obviously we do need an adequate amount of protein, but the amount of protein that we actually need to build the muscle isn't that much. Maybe 0 0.8 grams per pound of body weight is more than enough. So what I recommend buying is you want to buy whole foods, no packaged foods. And trust me, this is going to save you a ton of money. So the foods that I like to eat first thing in the morning is peanut butter, just because it keeps me full for like until lunch keeps me really full and it's loaded with protein too. So peanut butter is really good. Oatmeal first thing in the morning, a banana first thing in the morning. Not just protein, you want vitamins, minerals, and micronutrients too. You want a lot of different things in your diet to help you to build muscle. The next thing is I like carbohydrates, so pasta, rice, noodles, stuff like that. Those are really cheap foods. Potatoes, all really cheap, but all very good for carbohydrate intake. Um, Next one's gonna be ground beef and chicken and tuna. Where I'm from, tuna 80 cents a can gives you 30 grams of protein, which is very good. I would also consider whey protein as well. Um, peas and lentils, chickpeas, I also enjoy those. So you get quite a bit of oh, whole grain bread too. You get a lot of good foods like that, maybe cost me like 70 bucks a week if that at the grocery store. So it's very, very inexpensive. So that's what I would buy at the grocery store. I wouldn't go all out on buying all these different types of protein. I know people that spend $300 a week just on themselves buying a ton of protein. That's not necessary at all. So that's what I would do. I would buy those foods. And yeah, again, go with whole foods. Don't go with processed. Processed are way, way, way more unhealthy and they cost way more. So end of video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999.